Hello, my name is Lemon Zhang. I'm the general manager of Foodchem. And Foodchem is one of the biggest uh, food chemicals exporter in China. And we supply uh, more than 200 cans of food chemical products to uh, more than 120 countries. And uh, in our Shanghai headquarters, we have uh, more than 70 uh, people. And uh, for the game, we have a, a gelatin factory and we produce high quality food grade gelatin. Uh, thanks for choosing for the game as your uh, partner, and we believe for the game will be your best choice and your good partner in China. And we warmly welcome you to visit for the game in the near future. Thank you. Gelatine is made from a protein called collagen. The collagen is then hydrolyzed to produce gelatine. So what food is it in? Gelatine is used to make jelly, marshmallows, gummy sweets, yogurt and more. So where and why is it used? Gelatine is used for a whole host of things from food, pharmaceuticals, photography and even paper production. Gelatine is useful as it can be colourless, odourless and tasteless. It can be easily digested and soluble in hot water. It has the ability to form strong transparent gels and form a positive binding action. All these traits make it very versatile. Gelatine is used as a gelling or setting agent in cookery. Gelatin comes in either leaf or powdered form. To use powdered gelatin, put the desired amount into a small bowl or ramekin with double the amount of cold liquid and leave it for 5 minutes. This is called sponging. This can be water or liquid from your recipe such as milk, cream or juice. As a general rule, one tablespoon of powdered gelatin will softly set 570 milliliters of liquid. Now the recipe will usually say to stir the sponge gelatin into warm liquid to dissolve or put the bowl into a pan of barely simmering water for five minutes until it's completely liquid and clear of granules before stirring into the main mixture. Leaf gelatin comes in different sizes and strengths so it's always best to buy the recommended brand if one is stated in the recipe. Leaf gelatin is always soaked in cold water first for five minutes. Once soaked, remove from the water and squeeze it gently. Now the recipe will usually say to stir the soaked gelatin into warm liquid to dissolve it. Or your soaked gelatin should be put into a small bowl or ramekin over barely simmering water, as with the powdered gelatin, and leave it for five minutes until the liquid has cleared before using. Never overheat your gelatin or it won't set. To set alcohol or cream, levels will vary, so always follow the recipe.